All right, now we're going to do 8Q, pick a set of first elements. This is by Darlin Mendonca, and 91% of the people like it. We're going to write a function to get the first elements of a sequence. Passing a parameter in, default equals 1, will return the first in elements of a sequence. If in equals 0, return an empty sequence. All right, so with this one, we're just going to use slice. And the slice method returns a shallow copy of a portion of an array to into a new array object selected from start to end, end is not included, where start and end represent the index of items in that array, all right? The original array will not be modified. So that all being said, let's set up over here. And there's a little trick to this one. Uh, it's a little funny one, you know? A lot of these coders love making little jokes and tricking you. Because, I mean, that's what happens in real life. Uh, and so to do this, naturally we're going to want to do r.slice. And we're going to start at 0 and go all the way to n, right? Let's test it out. Oh, but in, we expected this and instead got this, all right? So that's because... In this case, uh, the in is undefined, right? And it doesn't say it anywhere here, but that's the only reason why that would happen. So in that case, we would say if in equals, pardon me, equals undefined, we're going to say r dot slice zero, oops, that's oh, zero to one. That way it just gets that first that first one, that first element. And then if not, do, uh, do what we thought we were going to do. And just like that, look at that. Attempt it. Awesome. Submit it. Very much like it. Let's go to My Solutions. Just me. Best practice on here. And we'll see you next time.